Happy Friday, Virgo. How are you doing today? Okay, let's get started on your reading. What's going on for you this weekend? This is your weekend reading. Oh, let's see. Here we go again. Just some sort of disagreement, you know. Uh, maybe this is you, Virgo, arguing with somebody, putting somebody in their place. <laughs> you know how we do it so well, you know, um, hurting somebody's feelings or um, just not. So don't mess with you. You know, don't start. And I won't be none. You want don't don't do anything to piss me off. Then you won't have to hear my mouth. You know, but it's always somebody got something to say, some kind of conflict with you. We've been getting this conflict card for quite a bit. I mean, really a lot. Okay. And and don't um, if you have an argument or something with somebody in kind of like or some sort of disagreement, just drop it. Don't keep on harping on it. Let it go. It's like it's just 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 don't even trip off of it. Don't worry about it. Woo! Didn't I just tell you not to trip off it, Virgo? Don't they leave people alone? If they piss you off, walk away and say I'm done. Just leave me alone. All right. So mm. I don't know who messing with you, Virgo, but let's tap into this energy and see what's up. All right. going on with Virgo, please. This disagreement, this argument, this conflict that earthly Virgo is going to, going through. We have the nine. Oh, so you, you, you like pissing people off. Okay. You liked, um, shaking people up. You like going off on people. Okay. It's like you enjoy telling, cursing somebody to fuck out. All right. I see that. Okay, Virgo. I hear you. This could also be an argument at a, a family gathering, <laughs> family barbecue, family get together, whatever, drinking too much. And, and all of a sudden that goes to bullshit. That's why I don't come to your house now. That's why I don't go over there to TT house. Cause every time I come over here, it's some kind of argument. Okay. Some kind of argument. People drinking, they get loud and they get obnoxious and they get crazy. All right. And then you, you sorry for what you said or sorry for what you did. Uh, in a drunken state or in a in in uh, inebriated state. All right, somebody drunk and they want to come in messing with you, Virgo. All right, but you, I just feel like this is a lot of people <laughs> pissing a lot of people off. Not just you. Uh, you possibly are the only person that said something. All right, it's somebody who you were at a party with some kind of kind of gathering, uh, possibly uh, recently or sometime in the near future. Drinking around some people and, and shit got started. See, fireworks started. Screaming and yelling at each other. Cursing people out. Cursing one another out or whatever. Dealing with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That could be somebody firing their mouth off. Whatever. And it caused a whole bunch of chaos and destruction. Like psh. Pushing each other. Fighting with each other. Y'all family. Y'all stop that fighting. Okay, we got the Angel of Miracles. It'll like it'll be a miracle if you can have a party or some sort of family get together or a gathering without somebody drunk causing trouble. This is a start over here from scratch. Maybe somebody wanted to apologize to you or the family for coming in and acting up. Got abundance here. All right. Um, I just feel like a lot of people were around here. Uh, abundance usually means money, but for this, I'm looking at there was a lot of people involved in this. Like. Everybody had an opinion. Everybody had something to say all because somebody got drunk and started acting crazy. Okay. Allow. We got allow and I have love. You know, um, just love this person in spite of what they're doing or what they've done. Okay. Have some, have some goals. Maybe this person should have some goals and learn how to come to people's house with some respect and dignity than, than trying to come in the house. And and eating up all the food and, and had to get together, having a nice time, and you want to drink and cause trouble with everybody. That's why you're not uh invited to other to other people's houses because you want to act ignorant, you know. The signals is is uh the alcohol. Like you can see, you can hear this person talking. Okay, or you can hear this person 
you know, slurring or whatever they're doing or talking crazy, talking some shit. You already know it's going gonna, it's gonna to be some problems. His mouth or her mouth that signals you that something is going to kick off. OK, I just feel like there's a lot of uh, nut, nuttiness <laughs> I'm hearing going on here with this energy with somebody, you know, arguing with somebody here in the family and maybe having the regrets after because nobody wants to, that's why nobody wants to deal with this person because they are always talking all that shit talking all that yin yang all right always got something to say that's why nobody wants to invite you over because you cause a lot of chaos and confusion okay this person possibly wants to apologize though i don't know i feel like this person they try, <laughs> I'll put it that way, they try. And I feel like this person is afraid to come around because they know that some of the family members don't appreciate them or don't. they don't want them around. But I feel like somebody, this person got an offer to come, maybe an invitation. Somebody physically invited this person to come to the gathering, all right? They feel so, they feel left out in the cold though, all right? And they've tried their best in the past to make amends, but but they still come in and, and, and mess up. They still come in. And I feel like whoever invited this person made it seem like they were going to come over and they were going to do everything in their power to do the right thing because they weren't invited to the last few parties or get togethers. And they say, this time I want to come. You know, I just like this person feels like the black sheep of the family. I'm hearing if that makes sense. But definitely um, they're they're I'm hearing they're, they're in a league all their own. And they they wanted to come, then they didn't want to come. They were talking to somebody, yeah, come on, you know. Um, I'm afraid to come. I, I just, you know, I just want everything to be okay. Uh, every time I come, you know, people don't like, they look at me all funny. And, and we got the courage card here. See, I feel like this person wanted to come or wanted to come in the past, but they didn't because people don't want them around because of how they act. Uh, and they know they act stupid when they get on 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 get high or, or drunk or whatever that fool on fool, as they say. You know, um, I just feel like this person had the courage to finally come, but they turned around, started drinking, and messed up again. You know, then it, you're not gonna get get invited to Thanksgiving holiday or Christmas. You better think twice. Nope, not gonna happen. What do you call those meals? Eat a TV dinner or something. We got the strength card. I feel like too there was somebody who fought who. I have strength and I have surrender. See, this person built up the bus, built up enough balls to to come. I'm hearing to be invited. So they were talking to somebody and somebody invited this person over, uh, like one of the family members. It could have. I won't say it's one of the younger people though. I feel like it could have been a um, an elder, like an older person who who not, they don't want to hear all that that shit. No, that's your family. He's going to be here or she's going to be here. I want him here. Well, well, mama or, or auntie Patty, Patty or, or whoever, Medea, you know how he act. You know how she be around everybody else. I want him here. Okay. So I feel like that's the only reason why he or she was invited to the family function because the elder wanted them there. The elder wanted them there, but it's not always a good thing. Got the emperor. The, see, this elder wanted that person there at that at that family gathering, and they know how how excuse me my expression, but they know how fucked up in the head this person is. But they still love the person, and they wanted this person to be a part of the family function. It's just that simple, you know. Yeah, you wanted uh, your your the elder could be you whoever uh, invited wanted this person invited. <laughs> you didn't want him there, Virgo. So I feel like whoever they were possibly talking to you or somebody else now, uh -uh, I don't want him here. I don't want her here. They're going to cause a bunch of problems. Okay, <laughs> So I feel like they were having a conversation with somebody here. Please invite Theo to the party. Okay, I want him here for the 4th of July. Or I want Sheba here at the party. Whatever. Nope, I'm not going to do it. Uh-uh. Okay. But... You had no choice or whoever was the person that was dishing out that invite, like the middleman. OK, I feel like they really didn't want to do it either. But they had. What can I say? That could be you. That's your sign, Virgo. But I feel like somebody, you know, really thought about it 
a lot before they invited this person to the party. They were all up in their feelings and emotions about it. And they didn't know exactly what to say to this person, possibly because they hadn't talked to that person in a while. Even if they have, you know, it was possibly just a pleasantry, like, hey, how you doing? And, and that, you know, and leaving it at that. But I just feel like this person has always felt like they weren't wanted around because of what they do. Okay. They, I feel like the elder wants, wants this person to work on them themselves. Uh, I feel like there was a hold up, you know, um, this person, it could be you or whoever else with this nine of cups energy wanted to invite this person to the party, but they didn't, they didn't want to, they held on, they held on it for a while because they know that this person likes to drink. And if it was left up to them, they wouldn't do it. I'm looking at the four, the four of pentacles, the nine of cups and the five of pentacles. This person just say, I'm not doing nothing because I know how this person likes to, likes to get down. I know how they get down. Okay. So I just feel like, no, in your mind or that person's mind who was supposed to be inviting this person, like in the back of my mind, I'm not even going to give out this invitation. I'm not going to say nothing to this person because I know how this person can be. But somebody changed their mind because the person showed up and did exactly what everybody thought they were going to do. Messed, every, messed everybody up. Messed the whole party up. Okay. The whole barbecue. Drinking and, and acting stupid. fire sign came back out fire you just, you, this person just put a lot of stuff out i'm hearing a lot of fiery words because we have communication here i just feel like this person did a lot of things like my daughter always tell me do you do too much so i feel like um this person whoever he or she is they do too much all right they do too much and now you know nobody wants this person around any kind of party any kind of gathering or anything because they talk shit when they get drunk you know they, they get drunk and start talking out the side of their neck and they don't care who they hurt, uh, phys mentally, physically, emotionally, I'm hearing verbally, or, you know, and then you want to use this foul language around the elders. You can't do that shit. You can't do it. All right. But this person does it. I still got abundance and the fight possibly started over some money that was owed. Okay. We got peace. Um, wanting some money or something that was owed. I have abundance and peace. You know, you're arguing over some money or whatever situation. Uh, and I have here peace. Just be at peace with this situation. There was not a lot of peace going on at that party. It was some sort of argument over some sort of money or something that was mishandled. Openness and magic. I feel like we had the magician card earlier. I feel like this person possibly borrowed some money from somebody and never paid it back and lied to him and lied and said, I did pay you that money back or you didn't pay all of it back. I gave you a certain amount and you want to bring me a third of that. Where's the rest of my motherfucking money? That kind of issue. All about the responsibility. OK, responsibility. If you're going to borrow it, pay it back. OK, and this person didn't pay it back. So I feel like that's what that argument was about. OK, I feel like this person just ruined everybody's good time. You know, how could you possibly come in here and ruin everybody's good time? We were having a good time until your ass showed up. We got infinity and reach for the stars. This person has to really um, start believing in themselves more. I feel like that's the problem that they have. Uh, they felt um, like nobody loved them or cared for them all of their life. They feel, like I said, the, like the black sheep of the family. So I hope that things will get worked out between you all, whoever this energy is for. Let's pull one more card. The Virgo family get together, ruined by an argument. Heart chakra. You all love each other, but sometimes, you know, arguments take place and you have to, you have to either deal with it or leave it alone. But at the same time, you still family, but you still gonna have your arguments and your disagreements. It's just that simple. All right. Talk to you later. Oh, don't forget you all to like, subscribe and share if you have not already done so. Thank you. Talk to you later.